Have you ever heard of the man who vanished into thin air with $200,000? This isn't the plot of a Hollywood thriller. It's the real-life saga of D.B. Cooper, an enigma wrapped in a mystery who pulled off one of the most audacious hijackings in history. It was November 24, 1971, when a man using the alias Dan Cooper boarded Northwest Orient Airlines Flight 305. The aircraft, a Boeing 727, was just a typical flight from Portland to Seattle. But Cooper had other plans. Clad in a business suit and sunglasses, he handed a note to a flight attendant, calmly declaring he had a bomb. The stakes were high. Cooper's demands were clear. $200,000 in cash, four parachutes, and a refueling truck, ready in Seattle. Authorities, weighing the lives of the 36 passengers against his demands, chose to comply. Upon landing in Seattle, Cooper exchanged the passengers for the ransom and parachutes. He then instructed the crew to head towards Mexico City, flying low and slow. But Cooper's plan didn't involve Mexico. Somewhere over the dense forests of Washington State, under the cover of night and rain, he leaped from the rear air stair of the plane and into legend. The search that ensued was one of the largest and most exhaustive in US history. Despite deploying every available resource, the FBI found themselves grappling with more questions than answers. Cooper had vanished, leaving behind only a clip-on tie and a mystery that would captivate the world. In 1980, a young boy stumbled upon a decaying package containing $3,000 from the ransom money along the Columbia River. This clue, however, only deepened the puzzle rather than solving it. The bills were traced back to the ransom, but how they ended up there and where Cooper went after his daring escape remained as elusive as ever. Decades passed and the legend of D.B. Cooper grew. In 2007, the FBI reignited interest with a new lead. A microscopic particle of rare titanium was discovered on the tie Cooper left behind. This hinted at a connection to the aerospace industry, sparking theories that Cooper might have been an employee at Boeing, potentially explaining his knowledge of the aircraft. As the years turned, the mystery of D.B. Cooper has infiltrated popular culture, inspiring films, books, and even an annual convention, CooperCon. Yet, the true identity of Cooper and his fate remain one of the greatest unsolved mysteries in the annals of American crime. So, what do you think happened to D.B. Cooper? Did he survive his perilous jump? Could he be living a quiet life, his audacious crime a secret only he knows? Dive into the comments and share your theories. The enigma of D.B. Cooper continues to intrigue and challenge us, a tantalizing puzzle waiting to be solved.